And the federal government has directed contractors handling the 107-kilometer Enugu Onisha Road dualization to speed up work on the project. This directive was given by the Minister of Work, Senator David Omahi, during a meeting with the MTN. The Enugu State Government and the contractors, ROCC Limited and Niger Cats Limited, on Friday. The minister expressed disappointment over the slow pace of work in the project. He also blamed the sufferings of road users on the lack of commitment and insensitivity of the contractors. I expressed my disappointment on the slow pace of work on that project. It's one of the worst roads in this country. Even where we have diversion, diverting from the one that our UCC and the Niger Cat had completed, the contractors are not kind enough to even push through this on the you know diversion point. So by the reason of the launching of uh, operation, we take a route. It is now and face with severe punishment for the controllers and directors where we have vehicles falling on any project that is our way or where we have you know, a situation where there are hot holes or bombs on our roads. Ten days ago, we launched Operation we Take Our Roads and it is very clear to all the directors and controllers and engineers what is required. We have been one in our contracts, we have you know, contingency. I will direct it where you issue directly to a contractor and he fails to do it. You should get a subcontractor to get some base to fill such potholes or holes. And there will be no basis for any worker or minister of works that fails to adhere to this strictly. And the way contractors refuse to obey this instruction will be sanctioned. The Colonel Steve. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.